Hello. There's a transfer chill in the air today and that's because the transfer window is still open. So here's your special deadline day forecast. Let's start in North London, where unusually for deadline day, it's looking nice and calm. Arsene Wenger has already brought in a central defender, so we might not get the usual build-up of anxiety and pressure. However, in West London, we can see this big front of potential transfer activity around Loftus Road, which will keep building as we approach the deadline. It hasn't been sorted 100%, but hopefully it will get sorted. You've had a medical, have you? No, I haven't had a medical yet. We had to drive down from uh, West Brom now. There's a big swathe of desperation at Villa Park following their recent gold drought. There are patches of potential activity in West Bromwich and Stoke, and possibly a bit more movement in Leicester as they look to improve their survival prospects. I will do my best here and we will stay in Premier League. And as we go further north, we can see a large build-up of speculation with an outside chance of spells of heavy spending in and around the Manchester area. Ivory Coast striker Wilfred Bonny has completed a move to Manchester City. Large amounts of high pressure continue to build up over Liverpool, but a big signing at either Anfield or Goodison Park could brighten things up considerably. Beautiful, yeah. Yeah, really good. We can see there are dark clouds looming over Newcastle as the frosty relations between the club's owners and fans continue. But the arrival of a striker could signal sunnier spells, as we've seen in Sunderland since the arrival of Jermaine Defoe. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's it for me. Keep across BBC Sport for all the very latest transfer deadline day news.